something under there. I hope it doesn't bite his nose. <sighs> Probably the fox. Could be any kind of animal. I don't know. No. Uh, today is the Feast of St. Matthew. And in the first reading, it's chapter 4 of Ephesians. And Paul is, uh, I think he's calling for unity as memory serves. Uh, you've been taught now. Um, keep the faith and keep firm in what we've taught you. Uh, Psalm 19, I believe, of which I forget what it was. And the gospel is the gospel of Matthew, where Matthew is um, sitting at the customs table, and Jesus comes up and says, come follow me. I think that's how it went. And Jesus goes and eats with Matthew at his uh, house. Toby, come. Gus, come. Toby, come. At uh, his house, and the Pharisees say, why, to the disciples, why does your teacher uh, eat with sinners and tax collectors? And Jesus overhears them and says, I did not come for the righteous, but for the sinners. To, um, and have you not read... I desire mercy, not sacrifice. And something else it says, what is that? Oh. Um, and so we remember that, Toby, come. Toby, come, or you're gonna get dragged under that, into that, and we won't be able to get you out. Um, it's, uh, we have the Gospel of Matthew. So I think the, I want to say in two different places it talks about teaching in the, in the uh, readings today. I think in the psalm it says something. I don't remember. But anyway, what I want to draw on is that um, we have the Gospel of Matthew, which was written to a Jewish audience. And it begins, come on, Toby, with the uh, genealogy, I believe, uh, which, you know, makes clear that Jesus is in that line of David, which makes him, uh, which makes it clearer that he is the Messiah. I mean, despite obviously all <laughs> performing miracles, forgiving sin and rising from the dead, if that's not enough. Um, but uh, somewhere, I think it says that uh, to teach, oh, in the in Ephesians, it says some are made to be uh, teachers, some uh, scholars, some um, evangelists. So, when we look at the uh, Matthew, who ends up writing this gospel, um, or at least he's credited with that. Uh, Matthew is teaching. He is a, uh, written a scholarly book, um, in essence. Uh, so, no. Toby? Okay, so, um, learn about your faith. Pray. Today, think of Saint Matthew. Wait, yes, Matthew. Um, and uh, try to spread the knowledge of the faith. For a person like me, I want to know the facts. I want to know the truth. And then, I don't care what, where the truth goes, but I want to be on the right side. And the right side is the side of truth. Yeah. Got there. So, um, pray, but also learn about your faith and think, discern, think of, think of different possibilities of an issue. Uh, use your uh, right judgment 
that you're supposed to practice and figure out what makes the most sense and take the knowledge that we get, particularly from the Gospels, and follow that truth uh, to its logical conclusions. Uh, I hope that makes some sense. That's all you need to know.